Easy iPhone 17 Pro Max or any other iPhone running the latest iOS stuck in a boot loop, it keeps restarting after the Apple logo, or your iPhone storage is full, so it reboots right after you go to the home screen, and your iPhone is stuck in an endless reboot, then stay tuned, cause I have a solution that might get your iPhone out of the boot loop without you needing to lose any data. First of all, if your iPhone turns off after the Apple logo, then let's plug in your charger and make sure your iPhone has enough charge. Just wait for a few minutes and then try to force restart your iPhone with the charger plugged in. To force restart, quickly press and release the volume up, then the volume down button, and right after that, hold down the side button and keep holding it until the Apple logo reappears. If the problem persists, then it can also be caused by a faulty charging brick or adapter. So first, make sure your iPhone port itself is clean and then try changing the cable and the power brick. Now, if your iPhone goes into reboot, as soon as you enter your passcode and it loads the home screen, then you probably know by now that your iPhone has ran out of storage and that's causing the trouble. But don't lose hope and try the following steps to the T. So what we need to do is somehow clear storage without loading the home screen. And to do that, your iPhone needs to be on the lock screen. So wait until it stops rebooting and you're on the lock screen. If you're not, then force restart it. And after you're in the lock screen, tap on the screen to wake it up and do not enter your passcode. What you need to do instead is make someone call your number. You may need to give your iPhone a few seconds. Now receive the call and while you're on call, go to more and try to add people. This will prompt you to enter the passcode and now you can do it safely without causing your iPhone to crash and go into reboot once again. Now that you're in this page, stay on the call, drag down to open the control center, expand the network section, long press on Wi-Fi and tap on Wi-Fi settings. So now we have successfully bypassed home screen and open settings. If you're unable to come here in the first try, just keep trying. After you're here, the rest of the process is easy. Just go back from Wi-Fi and now the other person can hang up the call. And from the settings, we'll go to general and iPhone storage. And now you can go ahead and start deleting apps to free up your iPhone storage. You should aim to free up at least 10 gigabytes. Just go ahead and delete the apps or offload them and when you're done freeing up enough storage, you should be able to exit out of settings straight to the home screen and now your iPhone won't go into boot loop. Hopefully this has worked out for you. If it did, all thanks to the Reddit user Daniel for coming up with such a brilliant solution. If it doesn't work out in the first try, don't hesitate to try again. But unfortunately, if you can't get it to work anyhow, then the only option you have left is trying to force update or erase your iPhone by connecting it to a Mac or a PC. And if you want a detailed guide on that, we have made this easy guide just for you. Let us know if this worked out for you, and good luck!